when they say pride will drain life out of you. I honestly think they were talking about men like Zola 7, and I don't mean to be disrespectful in any manner. Zola 7 has been known to be struggling with epilepsy and maybe other undisclosed illness that even affected his cash flow somehow. He was even involved in an accident and could not even repay the family that he had destroyed the property of, allegedly. Now that Twitter has begged him, he said, I have received hundreds of texts asking for my banking details. I see I'm training on Twitter and plenty of people are offering financial assistance as gratitude. I have never expected anything in return for the help I have given people in need. But this is truly humbling. Initially, I rejected notion because I am a proud Nguni man. Kodwa futi kutiwa ungabo jikisi isi po ospiwa sona. Ngapo diabonga guluva nation. I can't respond to all of you. Kodwa, here are my all banking details. Eni watilile, he said. T-Squad, however, this is not a gratitude kind of donation. No one is saying because you helped us, we are helping you. They are doing it out of love and concern after seeing him in a state that he is in. He did mention that he's a proud Nguni guy, but pride never got anyone premium health assistance or taken care of them and their loved ones. Thank you for your banking details, Kuluva. We are wishing you well and recovery. And to you, T-Squad, that has been saying, we need to help, we need to donate. Here are the banking details. Do the things. I love you.